keycard quickly. We're through. Oh my god, it's on us. It's got to hell in here, Samuels. It has gone to hell in here, Samuels, like you wouldn't believe. I remember this area as well. Right, what's our objective here? We've got to get to the operating theater and we can do that. Was that in the distance there? Or was that just a person? Where isn't this fucking alien, man? This is ridiculous. We're, we're just being hounded to the ends of the earth. Okay, I think it's probably safe to move up a little bit. Plenty of cover for us, though, which is something. Let's maybe nip into a side room just now while it's still knocking about. See if there's anything on the computers. We might need a key card at some point. Or, I mean, a key code at some point. I don't actually see any computers, though. Someone must know what's going on. Not me. Oh my god. That's just a person. We could lure the alien in to kill that person. That'd be pretty interesting. But I don't think we can just quietly beat him to death, you know? He just wants to see his family again. Aww. What? Oh Underway. shit. Don't make this hard. No, no worries, no worries. I'm, I'm easy, I'm going. I'm going. Don't worry about it. Don't worry about it. Easy. Easy, friend. I'm here I'm here for your ethanol and your ethanol only. Don't worry. There's an ID tag. Collectible, yay! And this thing will let us use something. We're in the MRI room. We can trap the alien in the MRI and then expose it to extreme magnetic rays which will cause it to explode potentially. I wouldn't expect it to explode actually. Hey, open up. He just beat me to death. Okay, fair enough. The irony being that the alien just popped right down behind him. Uh, so, I mean, I think I think our issue there was that we uh, took a wrong turn right away. I should have gone left, I went right. That took us to the wrong place. So, let's move on thusly. Let's go to the left rather than the right and we'll go in the correct direction to our objective, which is this way. Yeah, it's really gone to hell in here. She wasn't joking. Can Samuels even hear us? Let's update the map. Okay, so it's a little bit up in the air, but we'll head over, uh, head in this direction. It's a little bit hard to tell exactly where to go, but I'm sure that, oh, the, 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 yeah, the, it agrees. We're going in the right direction. you got to be careful on points like this, because sometimes it just waits in the vents for you, like a trap. You don't want to get the old alien trap, you know. This looks pretty operating theatery. Oh no. Samuels. I got it. I've got the meds. And I got an ID tag as well. The Access the medical reception. reception. Oh god, you've I've never seen somebody so dead. Oh god, it's around here. Right, where's the exit? Okay, so I've got to basically get to where I was last time to escape. That's fine, I can handle that, no bother. <laughs> Fucking zap it! I zapped it. And it's gone. Oh. How do we reload? Just change the battery. That's cute. It's duck under. Duck under. It's okay. Doesn't know where we are. Doesn't know where we are. We're heading. Where is it? It's close. It's around the corner. So we want to we want to head along there, we want to take a left and we want to follow the path all the way to the end. Which I mean admittedly easier said than done, but the alien's going in the other direction, so let's just make our peace and run. I mean not literally run, we wouldn't stand a chance if we chose to actually run, but we can walk with purpose at the very least. Is that a dead body? Oh no, another one. Another one with the old hole in the chest as well. Oh god. Oh god. Oh god. 
Oh god, need to be in a secure position. Safe. Don't worry. Don't worry. Okay, so it's still moving on. Right, we should be alright to move up. We should be alright. We should be alright. We're getting there. Let me just check the map. Yeah, we're going to want to take our right after here. Towards the exit. But we're okay. Got some revolver ammo and some ethanol. Yeah, we're heading towards the exit. We're just about there. Don't know where that guy with the gun is. Like, he's probably still kicking around here somewhere, but... We're making it. We're making it. Got more revolver ammo. Medical reception's a no-go. Medical reception is a no-go, okay. That's the only way through. Ripley, this is a public hospital. There has, has to be an evacuation procedure. There probably is an evacuation procedure. Initiate the evacuation process. Oh, we've got to get all the way back to the other side again. God almighty. Oh god. Don't mind me, friend. Don't mind. Don't mind me. Like, I scared him more than he scared me there. That was a shame. <laughs> Poor guy. Can we not just start a fire in the MRI room? Would that not do the same job but better? I am willing to shoot this guy if it, if it comes to... I'm not having my whole effort here be put to waste by some imbecile with a revolver like it was last time. Actually, actually, let's take a moment here. Let's duck underneath this. Go and build a med kit. And use it on ourselves, just on the off chance that we do take a stray bullet. It's harder to bloody select those than you would expect it to be. There you go. Sorted. So now we switch over to the med kit. Activate the med kit. Ah, lovely. Oh. Sounds like the alien got him. Or got somebody at least. It's going off in that direction, so let's move. Does it see me? <laughs> oh my god. That was weird. Just like dodging in behind it. Must be too dark for it. Doesn't like the dark, the poor alien. Yeah, that just, what did that, what triggered that? Nothing triggered that. The alien just decided it was going to come for a wee swing around here. God almighty. Should be able to make it past here. Yep, we're good in that regard. It's through in the other section. So let's keep moving. Let's keep moving. The only way to move is to move. Oh god, it's in front of us. But it's okay, we're tucked in. We're tucked in, we're using the age-old technique of hiding behind a hospital gurney. Wait, I'm getting two positives. I know what to do. Are those like human enemies? Or is it the alien? Human enemies, okay. There's one thing to do in this scenario. And let's lure them all together and have the alien kill our foes. Well, that didn't work. This is probably going to wind up getting us killed. Uh, well, it didn't work the way I expected it to work, I'm not going to lie. Oh, no, maybe I spoke too soon. Ah, brilliant, there you go. Have them all fight together. <coughs> In the living, breathing world that is Sefastopol Station. God, there's murders happening left, right and centre, but it was a necessary evil, I feel, in order to progress. For surely we would have perished, were it not for the friendly alien helping us with our woes which in this case amounted to humans causing grief and we don't want that, we want we want Sevastopol to be a friendly a friendly and loving place for all and we don't want people going about with guns because that is, uh, that's bad that's bad, we don't need people going about with guns, it's only gonna it's only gonna detract from the experience for others and how are we ever gonna be a famous theme park 
if we can't even if we can't even keep ourselves in check. Wouldn't you agree? Yeah, anyway, here we are. We've arrived in the plant room. It's a room full of plants, which is uh, probably one of my favourite places to be because uh, there's a save point. That's uh, that's all I'm really here for. Hostiles nearby? I'm not scared. I'm game for a save anyway. Boop. There we go. Current save complete. Nice one. Right, now let's figure out how to turn on the emergency protocol so that we can get out of this dump. I would imagine that we probably have to turn on the power. Oh, it's making noise. Oh, it's making so much noise. It made too much noise. Too scared. I'm gonna die. Okay, right. Oh, it makes noises that sound so much like aliens. I hate it. I hate it. And I do hate it, it's true. Oh, I see you, you cheeky bastard, with your slavers coming down like that. You can't fool me. Ah, uh, <laughs> if we'd walked underneath that, it would have done a, uh, like, instant death sort of animation type thing. We'd have wound up culling us stone deed. And we don't want that. It's actually gonna, yeah, there we go. Just a little bit of trouble activating the command point there for our button presses, but we made it. Excellent. I like this area, it looks pretty cool. I like the, uh, the, the light coming through, it's really pretty as well. Alright, well, now that we're making more noise than I thought it would be humanly possible to make, given the circumstances... Oh. So we've activated, uh, we've activated a working jaw. Good thing we've got noisemakers. We've got a noisemaker. We may not even need it though, we okay. might be able to okay. just... Shut up! Shut up! Okay. Shut up. Not now. Not now, exactly. I feel like we're gonna definitely get rumbled doing this. Oh, I've never felt so. No! I don't want to! We're being clubbed! I done a run. That draws alien. I don't want to draw alien. Ah, get off me! Oh! What's it doing? What's it doing? It's giving me the old choke. Get off. Ah, it got me again. Ah! I will shoot you in the face. God, you were a sturdy bastard, man. Come on, stay down. Oh, fuck. Oh, God. I know what to do. Escape. Haha. <laughs> This is when the aliens just kicking about behind us. Running causes accidents, he says. It's true, running does cause accidents. Go be careful when you're running around. I wonder if it knows if we're still here. I'm just, uh, I'm not entirely convinced that we got that entire, uh, that entire thing out of the way properly, and I want this, I want this guy dead. There we go, finally. Jeez, oh, that's an absolute machine of a, of a Molotov cocktail right there. You get rid of all the bullets, but I'd only fire at one. Oh, right, that feels like I'm gonna walk in front of its uh, vent. Gotta be careful for that, you gotta be constantly vigilant for the, for the alien's, like, slaver vent trap. Because it'll get you, and when it gets you, it gets you hard. And I don't want to get got. I don't know about you, but I'm feeling pretty fine with not being got. Alright, so we're just gonna carry on. Keep an eye out for any uh, for any dribbling on the floor. Like that. Right there. It's like a fucking minefield, man. Where isn't this alien? It's just always present. The old ever-present alien scenario. That's not something that you want to be part of, to be honest with you, because the alien is an apex predator killing machine. And as you can probably imagine, that is not the best thing to be when you effectively amount to prey in this situation. 
once again. Dodging the dribble. Good thing is, if it's dribbling out of a vent, I was about to say that means that it can't be elsewhere, but evidently it can be. Is there a way for me to get through? No, there's not. We've got to go around the long way. Okay. That's fine. That's fine. We can take that gradually. We can take that gradually, because there's the... Once again. Once again. You've got to listen. If you hear the hiss, that means that you're next to one of the... You're next to one of its vent traps. Okay. We're good so far. We're good so far. I'm thinking head right through this room. And then that's just a beeline to the exit. We're so close now. We are so close. Should have saved before I left that room, uh, to be honest, but it doesn't really matter. We're going to be okay. We are all but out. So close. Nearly. Nearly. Hooray! Victory was ours! And we move into another cutscene. <laughs> Holy shit! How did it know? Mother of God. But then fortunately, we were saved by a convenient explosion. And that will be the end of this part. Ah uh, yes, we wake up, there's fire everywhere. Thankfully the alien escaped, we were saved. L literally Deus Ex Machina, right there. We have been saved, but now we need to escape. In fact, we can't actually save right now, but so this part will continue for now. We will get to the next save point. But at any rate, it was very fortunate that that alien uh, was get, took enough time between appearing surprise style and then killing us. It's quite fortunate that that happened right before the explosion happened. Don't know why we caused an explosion. Don't know who caused the explosion. But the fact of the matter is we were saved by a mysterious explosion. So I don't know what to make of that. It was probably some sort of Sevastopol terrorist. But Ripley's in a right state now. I mean, her nerves would be fried. I would never enter a new area ever again if I was her. I would be so emotionally scarred. Tasty jump there. Oh, nearly fell. Close one. This is like alien resurrection all over again. You can do it. Displaying an impressive arm strength. She moves up the way. And then slithers into a vent. This is a vertical vent. These are the ones that the alien likes to hang around in. We don't want to be here. But at the same time, it's better than being in there. Because that place was on fire. And when you're on fire in space, well, oh, you're going to just wind up in a terrible state. A horrid, horrid situation indeed. But we're progressing just fine for now. Could use another med kit, so I'm gonna bust out another med kit. Yep, there we go. And we're gonna just jam that right into our arm. No point in putting it off. Not, not hugely efficient, only up to half HP, but it's better than being at no HP, I would say. We've also liquidized our revolver ammo by killing that working Joe, but to be honest. It's probably easier to kill him. Well, actually, we didn't need to because we'd already activated the necessary, uh, the necessary console to progress. But it doesn't really matter. We'll probably get more revolver ammo in time. The revolvers only have limited use anyway. But we plop down out here, and we progress. And it plays that alien song. No, 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 no. Anyhow, to Siegs and Synthex. Oh joy. We're going to the synthetic place. Caught in the trap. Oh no, we were caught in a trap. What was that trap for? Was that a trap for us? Pardon me. Was it a trap for us? Was it a trap for the alien? Was it a trap for just the random people walking about? Could it have been a trap for uh, our friend? Uh, Taylor? Or the other guy? Could have been. Could have been any of those things. Do you really only get one charge pack at a time? That doesn't seem right to me. It seems emotionally distressing. Or it's a charge pack, a uh, charge pack, a crafting item. Oh, there's a vent. Okay, we'll go through this vent. Need to find a safe point at any rate. No rush. No rush. But uh, that was an exciting part. Hopefully this will be a little bit more, uh, this next part. Will be a little bit more, well, less stressful. I don't think I could handle being stalked by the alien again right now. But, I mean, the alien will always be a threat because we have unpredictable alien turned on, so it will just show up at random times. Ah, well. 
What are you going to do? It just roams the station, causing havoc. And it doesn't havoc it causes. God, there's just a trail of destruction in its wake. There was an explosion last time, honestly. On a space station, what were they thinking? That's just dangerous. Plop down, and there we go. There is a peace myth in, apparently. I see. Need a compression cylinder. Well, we'll be doing that next part. Until then, I hope you enjoy these parts of Alien Isolation Unchained with the whole unpredictable alien and party starters, guns firing everywhere. We've got, pardon me, we've got molotovs, we've got smoke grenades, we've got this stun baton now. We've used it a couple of times to great effect, but most importantly, we avoided the alien via explosion. So, until next time, if you enjoyed, please remember to leave a like, comment, or subscribe. I would appreciate any of them, especially at this stage, because we need, I need exposure. I need exposure. Expose me. Expose me. Anyway. Even if you didn't enjoy it, a comment would be appreciated. I always like to improve. Thank you very much for watching. Thank you very much for your time. And I will see you again next time. Bye-bye for now.